Hey, this is Black Rose, and as you can see, I did change my username. Alright, Black Rose. I changed it back. I had this name years ago. I just got it back, so that's pretty cool. Um, this is my second Tazar video, says in the title. Uh, I didn't get any OB items in this video. All I did was get Tokel. It appears you get about 10k Tokel every 10 minutes, so yeah, let's get started. Um, as you know, I record the footage, then I do my commentary as I watch the footage. So in this video I don't have my goliath gloves but I did get my rapier which is new I just got my rapier but um, I do not have my goliath gloves and in my third video which is coming out right after this I'm wearing my goliath gloves because I just got them so I mean this video I s recorded yesterday but I'm just editing it now or not editing it but just put throwing it out there now so um, so yeah in my third video I have goliath gloves which I'm stoked about so I pretty much have all the best melee gear right now so I'm happy with that. Well, uh, the rapier and the glass gloves were kind of my main goals, and now that they're gone, I really don't know what to do. I mean, other than skills, um, I'm 90 crafting and 90 smithing and 98 woodcutting. Uh, I said I was going to work on those and get 99 in those just because I want 99 in those, but, you know, skilling nonstop to me now is getting pretty boring. So maybe I'll work on videos and switch off skilling. Um, I plan to be 99 woodcutting soon. I've been 90s in woodcutting for like ever so maybe I'll actually finish that but um other than that yeah those were my main goals so I'm trying to think of new goals to come up with uh new things to unlock and whatnot I mean swift gloves and everything would be cool to have but I really am sick of Dominion Tower right now I can't stand it anymore so um yeah so I'll just have to come up with new goals but like I said uh in this video, all I got was Tokel, no OB items, so I'm not even going to probably show my loot. So, uh, just to let you know, I got about in the... F well, I film every clip about 45 minutes, because um, it equals out to about 10, 10 minute long video, because I speed up by 410%. So, basically every video will be around 10, 10 minutes, so which means I'll have about 45k Tokel every video. But maybe I'll do a long one and speed it up more, or just maybe I'll... Uh, do more than one trips and just cut out sections and just skip to different sections um, maybe I'll go like two hours long of killing Tazar and then I'll show all the Tokel at the end skip through every different scenes or whatever I like but well, I'm not sure how I'm gonna do that yet we'll see um, my hunter guides coming out soon I hope uh, I've been working on that forever but um, hunter was my first 99 for those who do not know so that will be a great 99 to basically make a guide in I think for me at least um, Hunter could be kind of confusing for beginner players and that's exactly what my guides are mainly for is for beginners or lower to mid level players so I'm hoping that will help them out that's why I'm doing it so that's that and as for these new updates the clan avatar shits um, they drop angonic orts or something I don't know um, pretty much uh, I don't know what to think of that update, to be honest. Um, I don't really don't care for it at all. Um, I mean, usually when I skill, I'm alone, and the reason why I'm alone is because it slows down experience rate if when you're with a lot of friends, and having a bunch of clan members around you while skilling, to me, isn't that fun because you could just talk to them in chat anyways when you're alone. So, I mean, but it, it, they do have benefits and stuff, so that's pretty cool, I guess. But um, it wasn't really needed at all. If anything, I noticed this this week that uh, update the Black Titan, the Black Knight Titan. You guys need to really update those graphics. It looks so bootleg. You guys haven't updated that guy since like 2003. Yes, that's sarcasm, but still, seriously, update that Black Knight Titan. Really bad graphic. Um, I love what you guys kind of did to the Tazar. I mean, I know some friends that don't like it, but it looks way updated. It looks up to date in graphics and I think it looks great so you guys did a great job on that if you ever gonna see this video uh, hopefully you like my feedback but yeah I like the update to the Tazar city and whatnot um, it's kinda weird having a giant rock in the middle of the volcano now though it doesn't even really look like a volcano anymore it just looks like a hill with lava around it but whatever you guys did what you guys had to do I guess so 
Um, I don't know why you made the cave entrance so freaking gigantic. We're like two inches tall, so you know you don't need to make it like 50 feet tall. But uh, other than that, yeah, good update for the Tazar. We even though it's an old update, but still. Um, the Tiz Tokar Cal Cape update, uh, I didn't like it at first because the bottom was like a ball sack just hanging below your cape. But, I like it now, kind of, it just, I always like the trail, so it's okay. I th was thinking you guys would probably add purple to it because in the fight killing the monsters glow purple and not fire. Um, so I was thinking you guys would probably add that and I think it would match Torva a lot better. But other than that, uh, you guys didn't really try making it match Torva, you guys tried making it the theme of you know, to the Tizar, which are fire, lava, and rock. So I think you guys hit it pretty good. But um, yeah, other than that, I mean, the fire cape is still better. Uh, people like the fire look of the fire cape a lot more than Tokar Cow Cape still, which kind of sucks because Tokar Cow Cape is the better version. But whatever, it is what it is. Now, um, I'm pretty stoked about my rapier just because I've been using a whip vine forever, so I'm sick of the whip vine, I'm so sick of whips, I'm sick of all that crap, all the low levels could have them, I don't care, have the whip, I don't give a fuck anymore, even though they're classic, I'm so sick of it. Uh, rapier is actually pretty good, I've been using it in the Dominion Tower, I like it, it hits pretty often, um, very accurate, so I love it, but uh, yeah, that's my thought on the rapier, I'm, I'm stoked about it. Um, somebody asked me, oh, is whip better than rapier? In my opinion, hell no. I think the rapier actually destroys the whip, so that's that. But, I mean, I still love the whip in a way, just because it's classic, but still, sucks. I mean, when they came out with the whip fine, everybody thought it was going to be actually pretty good. Like, make it, you know, comparable to the actual rapier, but... Not at all, actually. All you did was make it so it poisons people, which is pretty cool. I mean, I like the fact that it poisons, but no. <laughs> the whip vine sucks, so yeah. One very stupid idea to me was um, when you buy the rapier, it comes 25% charged. So, I mean, you're losing 75% charge on it, so you have to r actually repair it right when you buy it, which is really stupid because, first of all, you spend 200,000 tokens on it just to buy it. Then you have to spend another 16,000 or uh, split the two, money and 16,000 tokens, um, to recharge it or whatever. So, of course, I just used money on it, but still, uh, that's pretty stupid that you'd give it to them when they first buy it with 25% charge. That, to me, is pointless. But, um, yeah, hope you guys changed that shit, to be honest. But that was really stupid, I and mean, I found that out, but it doesn't matter because it was like 1.6 mil to repair it. And it's 10 hour uh, combat, I think. It degrades fully in 10 hours of combat, so it's the same as Torva, and it's the same as Goliath Gloves, and every other degradable armor that's good, so, I mean... Other than that, I'm okay with it, I guess, because I'm just going to have to recharge my armor and everything, too, so it doesn't matter. But it was just kind of threw me off guard a little bit. So I don't think there's really anything else to talk about. I mean, this whole month, when I first saw the uh, August updates or whatever, um, where they talk about the updates coming out in August or whatever, uh, I read that, and I wasn't actually... I didn't care for any of the updates that they said they were releasing this month, so this month's kind of really bland and boring to me. Um, it seemed like a bunch of stupid updates that I really don't care about. So I hope they come out with something to get better next month, maybe keep me busy and make me happy a little bit, but um, yeah, this month wasn't that great. Also, um, if the uh, for the competition that I'm holding for this Tazar video, um, if the competition, I mean, if... The loot is way lower than what everybody's guessing because I'm assuming it will be. Um, I'm going to tell you guys a price range to guess between and then I'll choose the winner. And the winner has to be subscribed to me. Um, I'm not going to give money to somebody who's not even subscribed and doesn't watch my videos. So to that I say fuck you. So pretty much you have to be subscribed if you want the money. But um, other than that I'm going to probably post that in my very last video. Be like look you have to be subscribed to give you the full requirements and I'll have to see at the end of the all this, you know, this, all the video series that I'm doing for this competition, at the end, if it seems like the reward or the OB items price is really low, because they are only 30k each for every item or so, there's no way it's going to be like 5 mil, so, um, 
I'll let you guys know to guess between what price range and try not to copy somebody else's answer because then it will be hard to choose who wins. I'll just probably, if you guys do copy somebody else's answer, I'll probably go with the first comment um, that said that answer. So just try that. But uh, to give full information, I can't give you the full information yet on how or who might win because the price right now, because I didn't get any OB items this video, it doesn't seem like it's going to be that very good. Um, it seems like it's going to be a low ball number, so we'll see what happens. But uh, I'll let you guys know and tell you what's going on. All right, well, rate, comment, subscribe, do all that great stuff, and uh, have a great day, RuneScape.